Today we are going to sew a shopping bag from an old dress. Some clothes might not fit you anymore, or you might find some beautiful patterned fabric or old clothes from the secondhand store. Here I have a dress made of cotton fabric and it doesn't fit very well, but the fabric is pretty. So I'm going to use the skirt part of the dress to make into a shopping bag. This one has a button zipper in the front and a pocket on both sides, but it really doesn't matter. You can work with what you have. I'm also going to keep the lining fabric. It really doesn't matter as a shopping bag. This one comes with a belt and I'm going to use it as a handle for the shopping bag. I'm going to try to save most of the elements and not change too much. The first thing is to cut in half right above the belt area and leave some seam allowance so you can turn over and sew it. It's right there. And that's how it looks like after I cut it out and I sew it. I turn it over and hand sew it. Next, we sew a line along the button to close the button of the handbag. And you can sew it over the lining or below it. I actually sew it below it and uh, leave the lining alone. That's what it looks like after you sew the button line and turn it so it's right side out. And next we have to look at the edges. We want to make a button, so we fold it and make a little triangle on each side and make sure the seam line is matching from the side and the button. And then you can decide how wide you want the button piece to be. You just fold it and sew a line over it and do the same on the other side. And that's what it looks like after you sew lines in the button, one on each side. Because I have a button in the front, I'm going to reuse the button and uh, reattach it to the back side so it can close the opening of the back when needed. And I'm going to sew a line down to close the left and right side. And that's what it looks like after it's done. Now the button is attached to the back side so I can separate it from the front. This is a little detail that make it more practical to use. For the handle, I'm just reusing the old belt and I overlay on each other so it's thicker and I want to sew it, make a square shape to attach on each side. You can design the handle any way you want. I do it this way because that's just easier according to the original design. You can certainly cut out the handle and reattach it in the middle, the traditional way. That's how it looks like after it's done. You see the sewing of the square at the end of the handle. And that's the edge button. Now you have a big and lightweighted shopping bag. You can fold it and carry it with you anytime. It's environmental friendly and reduce the use of the plastic bag. I hope you enjoyed today's video and have fun sewing. See you next time.